My name is Martin Tillman. I'm a cellist. I'm a composer. 23 is actually when I came to America. I came to study at USC. I did a master's degree in classical performance for cello. I got this job, I believe, in a recording studio it's called Ground Control in Santa Monica. Because of the studio, I got to meet a lot of people in the recording industry and met bands and started playing. So I played from Sting to Shaka Khan, Elton John, and Drummerama, uh, Vanda Shepard, B.B. King. It's like, because you, you, you understand, aha, it's not about how fast you play, it's not about how you look, it's not about how you're young or how old you are, it's just how much energy you give. How much do you give of yourself? How much do you share of your, your love for music to the audience? And then I was on tour in Australia, I believe in 95. And I got a call from Hans Zimmer. And he said, I heard about you and your cello. And, and I was wondering if you wouldn't mind to stop by at the studio. We talk about this movie called The Fan. It's Robert De Niro and Wesley Snipes. And I told him, I'm back in three weeks. I'm coming to the studio. Let's see. So I. I where we're sitting right now, I sort of walked into this place, set up my cello. I had no idea what I was doing. I had no idea what does one do in a, in a, in a movie. So what is my role? So we learned as we went on and the hounds would sort of disappear and would sort of peek in like, so have you recorded anything? I was like, well, check this one out. He goes, oh, hmm. Well, at the time I thought it was very, uh, intimidated by, by his hmm. But then I, I, I noticed it was a hmm of, hmm, yeah, interesting. I think we can do this again. So the, the Middle Eastern album came about because I did a documentary called Trials from Syria. I actually got nominated for an Emmy Award. I always laugh about awards and since I'm nominated now, I find it interesting and like, wow, oh, that's cool. Black Hawk was definitely a huge impact. That sort of all came through my pores back and, and I sort of relived a bit all those worlds, the live performances with the Persian band, the Black Hawk Down and, uh, and other things. Uh, I did a movie called Passion of Christ. And I thought that's so cool because again, it shows you like with music, there's no, there's no borders.